today. This is smartwatchspecifications.com, the premier site for smartwatch specs, news, and reviews. Okay, we are back with our MD3 Max. Again, this is your MD3 Max smartwatch. And this time, we are going to check on the support app. Okay, so the features in the support app. So we have the mass wear support app available in Android and iOS. If you watch our previous videos on the installation of the app, there's a huge issue, there's a huge problem with the Android app application. Okay, it is not stable, it keeps on disconnecting. Hopefully, the, uh, the developer of the app will update okay, the app and of course, hopefully it will fix the problem. Okay. So here we installed the support app in our iOS and so far it works great and it is stable. So we are going to check on the watch faces and other features available in the support app. So if you have any questions regarding this video, just drop a comment below and we'll try to answer your queries if we do have the time. Okay, so let's start. So we have here our smartwatch as you can see. We do have, let's go first with the wallpaper, okay, or the watch faces, okay. So we have here several watch faces available in the smartwatch. It is preloaded with at least several watch faces. So let's check one, two, three, four, five, six. I like this one. So this one is just, it's beautiful as you can see there are a lot of details seven seven eight nine okay so we have at least nine watch faces so this one this is very familiar it's available in different applications for smart watches and so far as you can see here it is pretty beautiful you can also change it by long press on the smart watch Okay, on the screen okay all you or you can use the crown button here okay so here in our support app we have the details on the watch faces okay so here okay it's first time to see this okay so we have a skin switch so i wonder what skin switch is maybe the background okay so let's try so we only have two theme here Okay, so the skin switch is for the app, not the smartwatch. Okay, that is a bummer. Anyway, so let's go back. Okay, so we have here on the section, we have the dial. So tap on that. And we have here our smartwatch. Okay, so we have my dial. Okay, maybe this is the section for downloaded watch faces. Okay. Let's go back. We have the dial mall. And we have the local dial. So this one, what's this? Okay, so this is your, this is the section for downloaded, I think. Or maybe custom watch face. We have also a custom watch face here. And we have the dial mall. So let's try and install a watch face for our smartwatch tap on the dial mall so we have here several watch faces okay so we have analog digital okay do we have an animated watch face so i don't see any so far okay but we have a lot of watch faces and it's free okay so let's check and let's try to install a watch face okay so it has a comprehensive list of watch faces so let's check this one okay let's try this tap on the watch face listen to the rhythm get dial Okay, so let's see if it will be pushed to our smartwatch automatically and we'll see if it's successful without any issues, I think. Let's see, let's wait. 
Okay. So it's a bit slow. But it's working so far. 42%. 43, 44. We are on the 45%. Okay, so let's just wait. Okay, we are on the 97% now. 98, 99, and let's see. Okay, so we do have a successful downloading and installation of the watch race for our MD3 Max Smart Watch. Okay, so let's have okay another section of the wearable here or the watch face check let's check here on the local dial so we have here the downloaded watch face as you can see here okay this is our default let's switch to our to another watch face here as you can see so this is the purpose of the local dial for the my dial okay so somewhat similar also okay let's have another one else let's see if we can have or stored it in a war local dial okay so let's check so let's let's go for the analog type okay let's okay let's check this one okay Hopefully it's animated. Let's see. So zero point fifty two MB. Very light. Okay. Okay, we are on the ninety six percent here, ninety seven, and let's see. Okay. So that's it. It's now downloaded to our smartwatch. Okay. Let's go back again to our smartwatch repository here or smart watch face repository. Let's go to the local dial. Okay, so it has been replaced here. How about on my dial? So here, okay, all the downloaded watch face is available here. Okay. Tap on, check. Oh, okay. So it's disconnected or shut down let's see okay still connected dial and okay as you can see it is unstable also here in the ios platform hopefully they will fix this okay so going back to our dial let's go to the the diy dial or custom dial here okay so you have an option here okay so select image let's see okay so here we have chosen an image here confirm okay i don't, I don't want to i just proceeded to this section as i don't want you to see some of my photos here okay it's personal so let's check okay save and use let's go back here okay okay so we have here our design time and location let's check you can adjust it here save and use Okay, so we have here, we adjust, let's check again, set successfully, and after that, what's next? Okay, so it goes back again, okay, the app do have really an issue here, I think. 
so let's check anyways let's just try okay save and save and use okay is it no it did not change our watch face here okay again okay dial mo my local dial let's see no nope. my dial is it available here no nope. select image okay oh photos confirm okay so. okay as you can see okay no changes here did not say any upload save and use nope th there's no section for that how do i upload this one just set successfully but no details okay i'm confused if you have any solution for this one just drop a comment below but so far this section is not working the my dial section is also not working I'll just see huge issue with the mass wear support that okay right now i don't recommend you to buy a smartwatch that uses the support app or maybe the smartwatch okay so far there's a lot of issues we have an issue in our android and also this one although it is connected there's still some issues with the connectivity especially here for the watch face okay as we go on with the mass wear and the md3 max from time to time we from time to time we will check whether there are additional issues or maybe an update with the wearable okay so we have here automatic hr measurement 24 hour system and other options okay so far that's it for the changing of watch face okay a demo for the md3 max and so far we do have some issues although the connection here is stable as you can see for the watch face there are some problems so let's see if they will update the app also in android and the ios so that it will be stable for the md3 max smartwatch so if you have any questions or you have similar experience with the app just drop a comment below and of course we'll try to answer your queries if we do have that time again this is smartwatchspecifications.com the premier site for smartwatch specs news and reviews bye